Hi guys! Welcome to this video, Combinational Circuits Code Conversion Example. We've learned the design procedure in Combinational Circuit. Now we will apply it by designing a code converter that converts a binary coded decimal to the excess tree code for the decimal digit. So applying the procedures in design of designing of combinational circuits, step one is a specification of design object. But first, let us understand the requirement. Ang input ay binary coded decimal at ang output ay excess tree code. But ang input ay decimal and that is 0 to 9. And then, we have to convert it into binary. Ang binary equivalent niya ay from 0, 0, 0, 0 to 1, 0, 0, 1. Ang binary bit na kailangan natin ay apat. A, B, C, D as our variables for the input. At yung output, excess tree code. Yung 0, dapat may excess na 3. So, magpla-plus tayo ng 3. Each from 0 to 9. And our output is from 0 plus 3 is 3. 9 plus 3 is 12, so our output is from 3 to 12. Convert that into binary, and that is equivalent to 0011 to 1100. Apat na bits yung kailangan, W, X, Y, N, Z. Okay, so na-define na natin yung number ng input, apat, number ng output, apat. Next tayo, requirement is derive the truth table. So this is the truth table. Input, B, C, D. Output, excess 3 code. Si 0, dapat may excess na tatlo, and that is equivalent to 3, or equivalent to 0, 0, 1, 1, and 1, which is 0, 0, 0, 1, plus 3, kailangan may excess 3, which is 4, and that is equivalent to 0, 1, 0, 0. And gagawin natin yan, plus 3 lahat yan, up to 9. So you observe that meron tayong apat na binary bit. Ang apat na variable, ang maximum number na pwede niyang gawin ay from 0, 0, 0 to 1, 1, 1, 1. Pero, inabot lang tayo ng hanggang 9. So, anong gagawin natin sa 10 to 15? O yung 15 is 1, 1, 1, 1 sa binary, di ba? So, anong gagawin natin yan? We will view the 10 to 15 as don't care. So, hindi nula tayong pakalam kung ano man yung maging value nila para makompleto lang from 0, 0, 0 to 1, 1, 1, 1. Step number 3, obtain the simplified Boolean function. Nasaan ba yung mga output natin? Ang output natin ay W, X, Y, Z. So, we have to obtain the Boolean function of each output. So, output natin yung apat na yan. Unahin natin si W. Ang concern natin ay kung saan nag-1 si W. And that is in 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. Let's plot that into the K-map. For W, i-group natin siya. So, the maximum na pwede natin ma-group dito ay 16 ba? No, kasi wala namang value tong mga to. How about baba tayo sa 8? Meron ba? Yes, meron. Ito. And we will group that into group yellow. And to know the value of that mean term, A is 1, okay? 1, 0 para kay B, hindi pwede. At lalong-lalo na para kay C and D. Walang magkakaparehas na value para kay C. At ganun din kay D. The value then for group yellow is A. Meron pang natitirang 1, i-group natin. Let's group it into violet. So, A hindi pwede. B, parehas na 1. So, yan yung kukunin natin. Okay, si B. Sa taas, tingin tayo. C, hindi pwede. Magkaiba. 1, D, parehas. So, the value for group of violet is B, D. Group of blue, and that is for A, magkaiba yung value. Para kay 1, parehas ang value ni B. So, B tayo. And here, para kay C, yes. Para kay D, no. So, the value of this blue group is B, C. Simplify to minimize the number of gates to be used. That is W equal to A or B and with C or T. So, paano nangyari yun? Pinactor out natin si B dito sa dalawang main terms na to. For X, nag-1 si X sa 1, 2, 3, 4, and 9. We'll plot that into K-map for X, 1, 2, 2, 3, 4, 9. For x, that is equal to group number 1. Pwede natin siyang i-group by 4. Tignan natin. Para kay A, 0, 1. Hindi pwede. Para kay B, 0, 0. Okay. So, that is B prime. Para kay C, 0, 1. Hindi pwede. Para kay D, 1, 1. Okay. So, the value is for this first group, B prime and with D. Next group, group of yellow. So, this is in one group. Hindi pwede si A, si B, okay, B prime. Dito naman, C, okay, D, hindi pwede. So, the answer is B prime, 
C. 1 and X. So, group blue, A, hindi pwede. B, okay. And, and with C prime, D prime. Kasi 0, C prime, D prime. So, that is B and C prime, D prime. Simplifying the value of X to minimize the number of gates to be used, that is equal to B prime, C or D, or with B, C or D. D prime. Next output, Y. Output Y, saan banda nag-1? Nag-1 siya sa 0, sa 3, sa 4, sa 7, and sa 8. So, plot that into K-map. For Y, K-map. Group those adjacent cells. So, for group of yellow, A, walang magkakaparehas. B, walang magkakaparehas. Si C, C and D, pare-parehas. So, we'll get that value. C, D. Yes, meron pa. And that is group of blue. A, B. Walang magkakaparehas dito. So, we'll get the C prime, D prime. Dahil parehas na 0. C prime, D prime. Pwede bang isimplify? Yes, pwedeng isimplify. Kasi gumamit na tayo ng C or D prime. Or D. we can simplify that or we can convert. Because C prime, D prime is equivalent to C or D. Then, not. The Morgans. Next output is Z. Saan banda nag-1 si Z? Sa 0, sa 2, sa 4, sa 6, sa 8. And again, 10 to 15 will be viewed as don't cares. That's why we put X sa 10 to 15. So, tingin nyo, ilan kayang group ito? For Z, isang group lang yan. And that is color blue, blue group of blue kay A and B. Walang parehas na value. So, ang kukunin natin saan nagparehas dito sa my column. Si C, magkaiba. So, D, parehas na 0. So, Z is equal to D prime. And number 4, draw the logic diagram. So, gumamit ako ng online simulation, logic simulation. That is, ang ginamit ko dito ay logic that ly slash demo so demo lang ito let's try to simulate and verify the correctness of the design let's verify if this logic circuit produces the correct result by referring to the truth table for every input as you can see a b c d are our inputs w x y z are outputs a is the most significant bit for the input D is the least significant bit for the input W is the most significant bit for the output Z is the least significant bit for the output if we turn on the switch meaning it is 1 if this lamp turned on meaning the value is 1 and so to the different lamps ganun din dito sa different switches so let's try to simulate Hindi pa man tayo nagsisimulang nag-switch on para sa mga input na to, meron ng umilaw na YZ. Bakit kaya? Because yung ABCD na 0 natin ay dapat may excess 3 sa output. So ano ba yung 3 sa output? That is 0, 0, 1, 1. Let's try 1. So i-on natin si 1, dapat ang output ay 0, 1, 0, 0. Correct. I-on natin si C, that is 2, ang output ay 0, 1, 0, 1. Correct. For 3, plus 3 is 6, the output is 0, 1, 1, 0. For 7, for 7, 0, 1, 1, 1, the output plus 7 plus 3 is 10, 1, 0, 1, 0. For 9, for 9, that is 1, 0, 0, 1 in the input, and the output should be 1, 1, 0, 0. So, nakita nyo, correct yung result ng ginawa nating logic diagram. The simulator that I use for this is again logic.ly slash demo. It's an online logic simulator. Thank you for watching!